Forget what you think you know about protecting your large language model. We've all seen the headlines promising unbreakable AI defenses, firewalls, filters, and guardrails to keep your system safe. But what if all that security talk is actually a massive lie? What if those complex, expensive defenses meant to stop hackers are nothing more than a digital security blanket, giving you a dangerous, false sense of safety? I'm talking about the core of your AI. Are its protective barriers truly solid, or are we repeating the mistakes of the past, building a castle with walls made of cardboard? A shocking new academic paper just dropped, and it exposes the entire modern AI security world as a house of cards. They didn't just find a crack. They took a wrecking ball to 12 different established LLM defenses. The message is clear. Your AI is exposed. Welcome to Startup Hack. I'm Spencer, and we specialize in helping companies secure their organization. With a decade of executive leadership as a fractional CTO and 25 years in software development, I've enabled countless teams with their security and penetration testing needs. Like I said, the security on your sophisticated AI agent is likely pure theater. My two decades and a half in software development have shown me that when a defense is claimed to be near perfect, you should immediately start looking for the easy way around it. That's exactly what these researchers did. The security community has been trying to stop two big threats, jailbreaks, getting the AI to generate harmful stuff, and prompt injections, tricking the AI into running malicious commands remotely. This is the big takeaway. A dozen of the most recently published peer-reviewed defenses, techniques that use everything from prompt modification to output filtering, were all successfully defeated. Think about that for a second. 12 established solutions, all worthless. The simple truth is that many of the existing security protocols against both kinds of attacks were built on weak testing. They were designed to protect against basic hacks, not against smart, adaptive attackers. The old ways of testing security are completely obsolete in the new age of LLMs. And until we change how we test, every defense is a risk. Seriously, if you find this kind of technical breakdown helpful, leaving a comment is my favorite thing and the best compliment you can give me. It fuels the deep dive research for these videos, so drop your thoughts below. We have to talk about the danger of overconfidence. When these 12 defenses were first released by their creators, the academic reports often boasted an attack success rate, or ASR, of near zero. The message was, hey, we fixed it. Our AI is safe now. This creates a dangerous atmosphere where fractional CTOS and technical leaders, people like me, people like you, stop worrying about the problem. It gives the product teams a green light to push these agents to production with a dangerous assumption of safety. But the researchers here showed that this sense of security was totally baseless because the original testing protocols were amateur hour. They just used weak, non-adaptive attacks. That's like testing your bank vault by just asking nicely for the money. The paper clearly states that basing your entire security model on these old, weak tests is giving everyone, from the developers to the end users, a false comfort that could lead to a catastrophic security breach. If your current defensive testing isn't rigorous, you're not safe. You're just blissfully unaware of how vulnerable you are. So what happens when you stop being polite and start getting real? The moment the researchers swapped out the weak test for stronger, modern, and adaptive attacks, the results went from comforting to terrifying. They weren't just able to find a bypass. They were able to crush these defenses with a stunning attack success rate that often exceeded 90%. That means nine times out of 10, a smart attacker can get right past the security layer your company paid top dollar for. The secret? A technique called adaptive adversarial attacks. It's where the attacker's method constantly shifts, probes the defense for its smallest weakness, and then exploits that specific vulnerability. The defense is tuned to stop known attacks, but it's blind to anything new or slightly modified. In my world, that's just bad security hygiene. If your company is rolling out an AI agent right now, you need to understand the uncomfortable truth. You are probably more exposed than you've ever been before. Look, this channel thrives on your engagement, so please take a second right now, click that like button, and let me know in the comments. What's the one AI defense you trust the least right now? Seriously, I read every single one, and it helps guide what we dig into next on Startup Hack. And speaking of guides for a deeper rundown on the right skills developers need to be building right now to deal with this mess, check out the links below, especially for the fractional CTO advice and developer skills on startuphack.com. So what does this all mean for your startup, your tech team, or your product? It means you have to abandon the old way of thinking. You can't rely on off-the-shelf defenses that have already been proven inadequate. You must build a new kind of defense. This means incorporating adversarial training into your LLM development cycle, making sure your models are constantly being tested against the best, most adaptive attacks you can find, or even design. 
It means recognizing that LLM security is not a one-time feature, but a continuous penetration test. And most of all, it means not taking marketing claims or old academic papers at face value. The time for easy security is over. We need to get back to the fundamentals of rigorous, no excuses, defensive programming. Now, what are your thoughts on the security issue? Do you think this will be a big one? I love engaging in a good discussion. So make sure to drop a comment and remember to like and subscribe because here at Startup Pack, we love helping companies secure their business. With a decade of executive leadership as a fractional CTO and 25 years of software development, I love to help consult teams with their security needs and to help to provide security and pen testing. So reach out because our teams would love to help you. Hit the link down below and check out startuphacksecurity.com today.